Philippine Air Force was reported to have made a re-evaluation of their fighter aircraft competition selection, with a Saab JAS-39 CD Gripen said to now edging out its only competitor. The Lockheed Martin F-16 Block 70 Viper. The offer from Lockheed Martin for 12 new F-16 CD Block 70 Viper fighter aircraft was said to be valued more than the PS budget for the project. And was also higher than Saab's offer for 12 new JAS-39 CD Gripen fighters. Also, Lockheed Martin could only commit to deliver the first batch of three or four aircraft beyond three years, which is around 2025 to 2026. Compared to Saab's commitment to start delivery in less than two years from release of notice to proceed. Both companies have made extra offers on top of the requirement for 12 and new fighter aircraft. The Philippine Air Force could be chasing the contract to be signed with the selected aircraft supplier before the end of 2021. As its chances of moving forward may be hampered by the country's national elections in May 2022. The Philippine Air Force has officially raised a requirement for new fighter aircraft in 2018, but has been planning and evaluating offers from American, European, and Russian companies years before. Prior to this current fighter aircraft competition, the PF has previous failed attempts to procure new fighters due to successive financial issues since the early 1990s. The PF only restarted conducting fighter and air defense operations in 2015 with the introduction of 12 new FA-50PH Fighting Eagle light combat aircraft from Korea Aerospace Industries. After losing fighter capability for 10 years starting in 2005 with the retirement of the last Northrop F-5AB Freedom Fighter aircraft. This fighter requirement is part of the PFS modernization program covering years 2018 to 2022. While additional fighter aircraft are planned for acquisition during the 2023 to 2028 phase of the program, 